Hello there! Mando Boy here, and you are pretty hyped after the Nintendo Direct that happened uh, a week ago. So, I saw that the Azores Remaster is gonna happen, or Smash Remake. So, hey, now's a good time as ever to give it a try, right? Fans Wars. I haven't really touched this game ever. I don't think I've ever did. Like, not even as a kid. Oh, this sounds like a great time to go for it. Welcome to Dance Wars. Listen to your name. Is it even a fan? Oh, it did. Perfectly. Yes, sir. Oh, yes, miss. I still need to win a new I'm now. I'm a CEO in the Orange Star Army. Is it your first time playing? Yes. Very well, let me explain a few things quickly. There are several different modes of game. The person mode is for multiplayer battle with one one Oh, That sounds cool. The bad last person mode is send you need the link thing. There's field training. You play for the first time, you just find the field training. You go and you gotta play through the tutorial, boy. Aye, right, sure. I can instruct you and battle strategy. Complete the missions from top to bottom. First person to zoom orders. Let's start here. First small field training. Wow. I guess I guess I can go into the mission, take a mission until I actually finish the tutorial. Damn, that's kind of crazy. More games should do that, maybe. I mean, it is annoying, but maybe they should do that more often. Basic troop movement and attack controls as play here. First, let me bring you on the situation. We're in this large nation here, the Orange Star. The country to the east is the Blue Moon. The two countries have been better rivals for years. Other skirmishes have died down recently. Until that madman Olaf. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. I mean, uh, the Blue Moon CEO Olaf suddenly the ordered an invasion of Orange Town. So the Alara region is now held by Blue Moon forces. Candidate Munandu, you can be given a mission to drive Olaf from Alara and secure it for Orange Star. I'll be in support. Let's move out. Two orders. Alright, day one. Then, the Alara region is quite remote. That's why all of us in the point when it took to Hmm, this is catchy. You still have two infantry units under your command. These orange units are yours. Alright, sure. Damn, I'm so used to being the blue guys because of Fire Emblem. <laughs> the blue guys are the bad guys now, that's crazy. If you need forces to complete the mission successful. Alright, sure. Let's issue some orders. The cursor is used to give commands. Control pad was the cursor. First, let's command the infantry unit. Would you place the cursor on the infantry unit, please? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah look. This is the grid, just like in Fire Emblem. The action you use completed is called selecting. You see this terror often, so do your best to remember. Okay, sure. When you select the unit, the only around will become highlighted. This arrow represents the selected unit's range of movement. Only three squares, huh? First, that's the first unit with this unit. Have you been the unit to this place? Aye, right, sure. The unit moves, this unit will appear. It's like, wait. In this color change, right? Oh yeah, it becomes gray after it moves. Nice. And move again. Don't worry, you'll be able to move again on the next turn. Now move this other dude too. Ah, oh, actually. Sure. This music's pretty catchy. I like it. Both of your units have finished their movements for this turn. When you finish giving orders to your units, you must end your turn. Press the A button on the empty space. I'm okay. Anyway, end your turn. All right. Let me check this. Gas. Bounce type. Ooh, okay. This. We're gonna have to learn a lot with this game, aren't we? <laughs> Very. I don't know how to explain it. I like the drop so. Our star army has moved into the lower region. Ah, they will last long. My troops there will make short work of them. Oh god, they gotta move the cursor in the show. Hey, two! Who's the girl has noticed our arrival? His infantry units are heading this way. Take calm. If we proceed with caution, we'll be fine. Now it's time to order the infantry duty to fire! Anyway. It must be next to okay, one range attack. Alright. Select the command. 
The curse that you use to select the original target. There's only one unit can engage. Super team on the fire. Uh, damage 49%. Plane 1 defense. Infantry has 10 hearts. I don't know what that is. That's fuel. Which is, uh, I guess if you run out of fuel, I guess you can't move anymore, even though there are people, which is kind of weird, but whatever, sure. Let's go with that. Go, soldiers. Pretty cool. Let's go damage on the enemy. You see the numbers on the units? This indicates the unit's HP. All units begin with 10 HP, but as they take damage in battle, the HP will decrease. Okay. When a user reaches 0 HP, they will vanish from the screen. Notice that your unit has more HP than the enemy unit. This is because unit that attacks first generally has the advantage. Waiting to be attacked is not a good strategy. Yes, sir. You should your battles and always fall first. If you fire on this unit again, you should defeat it. So now order your remaining infantry to engage the enemy. Got you. 52% damn, okay. That's a rip. Crappy face, sad face. Congratulations, you just committed murder. There's so much an enemy you have to deal with. If you stick to your battle plan, you can finish it off too. So like end from the menu and continue to your next turn. What are those foes doing? If you're in the battle, they wouldn't be suffering such rejuvenation. Curse or star me, I will defeat it. Hey, three. It's your turn again. You have a 2 to 1 advantage. This battle is yours to win. Wait a minute. You see, they took damage in the last battle, then you just lose some of their firepower when damage. So it's better to fire an enemy with a non damage unit. Oh, okay, okay. So if you use HP, you lose attack power? Damn, okay. Alright. Always attack with the full HP induced first, okay. How about if I. Oh, yeah, I can't cancel it. Right. This is how the A button is used to select units and issue commands. If you make a mistake and want to change orders, use the B button. It's key that you remember this. Now that the enemy unit is damaged, you can kill it. Ooh, I like this cursor sound. Cancel? Yep. Yes, it is. Sir, we can. Goodbye, blue unit. You defeated! Defeated, not killed, because obviously they just exploded. They only been defeated, they are not dead at all. The mission is a success, keep up the good work. Inconceivable! This dog was mine, how did I lose it so easily? I stopped it through with mine. At least you didn't know you won, now you will see the rank that your strategy has earned. You will speed is based on how quickly you won, what part is based on how well you concentrate your attacks and overcame your enemy's techniques. Ugh, that's a lot of reading. Compare scores to friends? I'm gonna get a D rank anyway, don't worry about it. I sure say. This mission focuses on defensive terrain cover. Oh boy, that's a long tutorial. Ah, it's sure. A lot of mountains. Where the tag? You give four infantry units. Alright. Ooh, okay, okay. Then you can put some mech units. Drop. You can use have more firepower than your standard infantry do. That absolutely. You won't be able to defeat mech units in the right. So you have to use the terrain to keep some basic cover. Oh, okay. I'll spin them on terrain future search. So you can continue, please. Excellent. Okay, so I can see if I turn you next, please. Uh, should we kill this guy? Okay. So I can see if I go. Damn, was that not clear? God damn. Ah, she's the bossy type. Okay. You know, this is really different. Up till now, the highlight of moving from infantry has three spaces. On the mountains, it's less. Moving cost is double here. This means your movement rate with half of that on the planes. Do you think the mission should load mountains? That'll be a serious tactical error. 
Not this of fusion field when there's the compass of a moment pass. You get extra defense and shit, right? Let me see. Ooh, four star defense. That's pretty. That looks pretty nice. I don't know what exactly the stars means, but it cool, right? Oh, okay. Now compared. Oh, that's pretty clever, actually. <laughs> now compared to the speed of two infantry units that use attack. One has eight and one has nine. Yep. I said cover because of the terrain. Attack the enemy from the mountains, right? Defensive cover in the mountains is this number here, a four. Defensive cover on the plains is a one. To have the defensive cover rating is the best damage you take. Him. That clear? That's pretty good. Alright. That's that's pretty clever. I didn't think they would teach me that. Oh I can. Goodbye. This is probably to teach you now. You know, this 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 probably to teach you that uh, this guy's gonna take not much damage from the back and this guy's gonna take a shit ton of damage from the back, right? Can I wait? Maybe I can. Nope. <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess that is an intention. Catchy spark music. So inspired by troops, have you? You're pretty good. But this time, this was different. To learn what it means to fix, make me units. I just keep watch from here. Don't need more need for me to actually be on the field. I'm still in charge though. <laughs> Charm. Charm. Ooh, that 58. Damn, okay. Ouch, ouch. For HP. And how much is this dude gonna have? 39. Ooh. That's that's a big difference actually. Yeah, 4 to 6. Yeah. Your job. Make units really pack a punch, don't they? But if you know this one, you continue mean with less damage and be way less damage and be alright. You know why? Because of the defensive terrain. Yes, yes. You, you taught me that lesson the first time. Come on, then. Oh, wait. The effective terrain movement costs are different. Oh, okay. And in this place, of course, you and press the R button. More so terrain features are better for all units. Superior! Numbers. This increases when you look at them. Infantry 2, make 1. Oh, okay. Oh, you always attack with the 2 with the higher HP first. There we go. What is please should not be doing that much damage now? How much on the forest? Two. That's not too. That's not too much. Can I just wait here? Yeah. <coughs> Oh, they don't even... Okay. Oh, one more thing. If I didn't point during battle, you need to stop. There's a way to save. Same will prevent you from having to start the same mission over again. Please go to the map menu now. Place the cursor in an empty space and press the A button. There's a save command, yeah? So let to save your press during battle. Alright, like I said, this is gonna be like suspect. I need right now.
He should finish it, I think. Yes, sir! Crap, crap, crap. Anyone can finish this one. Kaboom! You did it! The scene is really where you recovered operation. Thanks to your planning, our troops took minimal damage. Keep up the good work. Ah, another failure. Our troops make careful planning another botch mission. Your next level will prevail. Okay, sure. You only have like 20, 20 more tutorials, don't worry about anything. Give me the day, Wink. Yep. Let me, see, let me see how many actually are. Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Plus the first two, that means there's 14. Whoosh! Alright. Can we store the sparkles? If successful, we should be able to drive that on Oh, Well, <clears throat> oh, you should respect that man, don't you? We should be able to force the blue monsters to withdraw. You remember the phase 2 mech units in the last battle, right? In response, you've been given command of 2 mech units yourself. Nice! Dun -dun. Oh wow, this map is way bigger. Hold up. Dun, 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 dun. That's it. This area is crucial to the face of the Alara region. This place the four enemy tanks units that are even waiting for us. I thought it was those were ours because they're blue and I'm I'm using I'm still used to fire weapon. <laughs> Fortunately for us, these tanks may not cross the mountains. Alright, let's take care of business here first and deal with them later. Let's secure some bases by capturing the local cities. Damn, alright? Just, just capture a city? Who cares about the dudes here, am I right, fellas? <laughs> Sorry, BC for two units, please! You will be here! Sure. You see the new menu command? Capture? Let's start this command. Pew, pew, pew. All right, just stop the city. Okay, the city is now half captured. It takes at least two days to capture a city. Order you need to capture again next turn to secure an ally base. I almost forgot. The mobile unit is in the process of capturing a city. If you do, you have to begin capturing all over again. Oh, okay. That is kind of a big deal. The same is true that if they capture the unit, it loses all of its HP. Do your best to protect the units that are trying to capture. All right. Got it. Now let's move this make unit. Only infantry and make units can come capture the bases. Remember this when deploying units into the insecure areas. So only the the infantry dudes. Not uh, no tanks, no nothing else. Now go ahead and move the rest of your units close to the cities. Back then when you're finished moving. Nani? And he forces himself over here again! Those cowards stuck in my most remote units! How typical! Wait, I have some tank units deployed here. Crushing those infantry man units will be a piece of cake. First, fight all my little troops, this time we should be victorious! It's your turn! First, you should always start by completing the capture of cities. Please select this infantry unit, I press the A button. Alright, sure. Pew 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 pew! Capture! Now, this city is yours! It's the same color as your troops, right? You can use it now as a base! So now you can use that... You can see that the cities are under enemy control. By the way, gray cities are neutral. Let's get back to discussing bases. If you put a damage unit in a base, it will recover some HP each turn. Okay. Just like a... It's like they're all thrones. You also receive a thousand gold per day from each city you capture, okay. This was a crucial for storing HP for your units, really. Funds are also used for other purposes, I'll explain those later. Alright, gotta use the money. Now use this man unit to capture a new base, would you please select this unit? Now here's a problem for you, two cities are within your movement range. One is neutral and one is hostile, which one should you capture first? 
uh, we gotta take the money from them, right? Yep, that's the correct choice. Of course, capturing either one of these cities is a plus for you. But if you secure the enemy city, you also reduce your force money. Oh, I was right. <laughs> oh yes, there's one more thing you need to know. Look here to see how long it will take to secure the city. The capture number is now 10. When this number is reduced to zero, the city is secure. An infantry unit has 10 HP, so it takes two days to capture a city with a capture number of 20. A damage unit has less HP, so it will take longer to... F oh, okay, okay, so... If you get hit, then it's no longer two turns, it's now three turns. And if you keep getting hit, it just goes longer, or you have to try again with another unit. That sounds pretty annoying, honestly. <laughs> So you now know how to capture cities, right? I'm going to let you make all the command decisions from now on. Would you like some advice on how to proceed? Uh, sure. Naturally, you can win this battle by defeating all of the enemy units. However, the enemy tanks are extremely powerful. Finding head on is not an advisable strategy. I suggest waiting for by your bases and taking out all. Oh, we be camping? Ah, uh, that. Avoid the tank units as you try to capture this queue. The weakness of tank units is that their first will allow them to move from weapons. Place them with caution on unit on terrain and press the R button for more valuable intel. One last thing. Don't let the enemy capture your skill. You will lose it this set. Okay, sure. <laughs> That's all. Good luck. That's all I can do for now. Capture Give me that city. Uh, I can't move here because uh, they will be on the city. I'm gonna have to. Actually, I should wait here. Ah, damn, they're gonna be on the mountains. That's what? No! Ah, uh, fuck it. I'll capture it in the other way. I, I, I can't let them get the mountains. How we start, I don't care. Oh shit, they did they, they, they didn't attack, they just blamed the mountains. Come on AI, don't do this to me. Oh, I can't fight these guys. Someone has to die, I'd rather it be the infantry than these guys. I gotta keep my mech dudes alive. Can we kill these guys? No. Oh, wait, we can. Let's go. Pew, pew, pew. Nice. Fuck that base, I'll get it later. Oh, they're not even attacking? Oh, shit, okay. Not my best choice. Ouch, ouch. Okay, we don't do damage at all to tanks. I died, I died. Well, the tanks are gonna have to take the long way, so... I win my caption in the other enemies, right? Yeah, so yeah, I mean, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna try to bait these tanks down here. Oh wait, no, they can't even get out. They're stuck there. 
Oh, so yeah, wait, can you? No, wait, you can't. Okay, wait, wait, we can just move this guy and get the capture from the bottom. I just gotta make sure these mech dudes uh, don't do anything. Hey, nice, right. nice. Nice. What's your attack range? Let's kill some of these guys. Oh man, we are even. That's not very good. Oh, I'm gonna. Ah, oh, shit! I just sacked this guy for no reason. Oops. For poof. Uh, maybe, maybe we can bait them to kill the infantry instead of the mech. Thirty-seven percent. Ah, that's not gonna kill, right? Because they have 4 HP, but oh, maybe you can leave it in 1 HP and then we they'll do no damage. Oh shit, he killed! Nice. Ouchy, ouch. It's just done. Uh... Oh, they can't really do anything to us, so I'm just gonna keep moving downstairs. Maybe I'll have one of spade. Gonna do anything, right? Alright, let's go. Maybe I can do something upstairs. We'll be able to still get to cap on the next turn. I'm probably not gonna get an A rank, but... Maybe I'll get a, a better rank because I want some background from HP, and... Woo! Alright, let's go. Outstanding! You reclaim the Aryan Force to move to withdraw. There's one more thing I have to tell you. You receive funds by capturing shields, right? But once you clear a map, you lose those funds. Sorry! Oh, okay. Good luck on the next one. Okay. I guess you just have to spend everything you got. Unbelievable. We were forced to withdraw. What's going on? What were the tank units doing? This is. Well, I mean, your base was surrounded by mountains, bro. I'm sorry. <laughs> but I have to wait. Still got an A run. Let's go. Oh, clap, clap, clap. Say Corona, yes, sir. Okay. It's a pretty long tutorial, but I, I I do feel like I'm learning. I think that creep, <laughs> that uh, CEO Olaf is starting to take us seriously, but all of our commanders are gonna be in other campaigns, so there's no one available to lead the orange star against him. 
Whatever, looks like it's up to you to defend our star. Let me brief you on that current mission. Our troops en route to the last fortress. Lost fortress have been waylaid by Olaf. It's up to you to join up with them. Bait back Olaf and secure the area. We need the lost fortress. Move on. You need prepare. Alright, oh oh. Damn, alright, those those tanks are. Uh... Stay hydrated. <clears throat> Those tanks look pretty damaged. When Olo has his bases covered, it looks like he understands the importance of holding this area. Almost all of our units in the Fort Lost Fortress have been eliminated. There are only two tank units left on the original contingent. We must repair them in order to have all any hopes of winning here. So first, let's pull this two unit back here and parse them back. We use like this tank unit, please. Oh shit, these tanks move a lot. Hold up. To repair a unit. That's one, two, three, four, five. That's like five squares. Damn. All right, to repair units, move it to a valid city or secure a base. This tank unit can make it to this city. Please move it here. I right, sure. Oh, that's right. This tank unit will now recover two HP for the tournament state here. All right, now let's redo this tank unit too. Can you select it, please? Let's see. Two. I'd like to repair this now, but there's no safe place within this movement range. There's nothing we can do about it. Let's get as close to the seat as possible, making repairs the next turn. Alright, sure. That's right, thank you. But we can't stop here, can we? The unit's still vulnerable to attack from the enemy tank unit. Place the cursor on the unit and press the B button to check its attack range. The area it can fire upon will appear in red. But well, what to do now? How about giving a little assistance? The code other units around it to prevent it from being attacked. This act is called building an offensive wall. This tech it's also called sacking units for the greater good. <laughs> you, you see the attack to the face, bro. You'll be fine. We'll be here to create a defensive wall. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. My bad, I misclicked. <laughs> oh, someone's gonna take the L, bro. I'm sorry. There, now the unit's safe from the enemy attack. The enemy units cannot cross allied lines and vice versa. You can see why the defensive wall is such an effective charging unit to uh, the make the make unit will come under fire, but you should be able to hold one turn. Now we have two make units, we should be cave for two days. So move the make units up and deploy the police infantry as you like. Please end when you're finished. I think that's supposed to happen, but uh, But <laughs> aha, the overstar forces have arrived. It looks like the group that's been giving me some trouble too, but they didn't have one decent time with them. I have nothing to fear from these fragged fools. Prepare to be routed. Your turn. The enemy is close in, but the tanks need more time for repairs. If we're getting two HP per day, we're not going to be ready time. It looks like we'll have to join these two units together. Person, please select this tank unit. Oh, wait, you can combine? Wait, put the cursor here, move it to this spot. Select join from the menu, please. Damn, they, you can't combine this. The units have emerged. When two units join, they combine their HP. Of course, now there's only one unit, but I know that two units may seem better than one at most times because uh, they do more damage. Uh, they, they do more damage if they have higher HP than uh, two units that are in low HP, right? I recommend you to join when you feel it's necessary. I'm going to leave the rest of this mission to you. Do you want some message for sure? The tank unit will have full HP and we need to go on the next one. First, use your make and tank units to destroy the enemy units. Your make units take too much damage, you're joined to march them. If you can just get rid of all the tank units, you'll sure win. As long as you keep your HQ from being seized, you can lose. You can also win by capturing the enemy's HQ. It'll be faster to the field of the enemy. Good luck. I think I can. What happens if I jump with a full HP? I want to see what happens. Oh, you lose the surplus. Oh, shit. I, I fucked up. <laughs> I fucked up. Oops. That was not my best decision if I... That was not my best decision. Alright, so this guy will have will want to capture, so I think I think I can send one of these. 
Actually, if I if I yeah, he want to capture, so he can just attack on the same. How about do bait for the top and then have one another to try to capture? Oh, we took away the damage now. That's nice. Get so far, get so far. Oh, I should be able to tackle this, right? That's uh, 55%. Yeah, there, you are there. Clap, clap, clap. Move you. Attack to the sea because we have best defense here. Boom. I think I'll move this guy here in case we need someone to take the take the damage. Uh, we'll weaken this unit to the point where they can oh never mind they're dead. <laughs> that will do for now. Oh no, they captured a base! What will I do? You survive one turn? I think you do. Well, I hope you do. <laughs> oh shit! No! My strategy! I didn't think he was. They did it because he saw that my dude had no terrain. Damn. Talk about tough. Tough love. But I think that means this guy can start moving now. I think. Or not. There's still a mech guy. Does the water have defense? No. Okay. Oh wait, but this means this means this tank cannot move anymore. Okay. We'll just wait here and have this dude here. <laughs> yep. Ah oh, shit, now we can move again. But... We can start attacking this unit. If the tank kills our next turn, it's fine. I mean, I'm not gonna get an A rank, but whatever, right? I can may not move at all. <laughs> Goodbye, infantry. Oh wow, they don't even I don't think we should suicide. Alright, forty nine percent. Now we now we got the terrain and we can attack it. Yes sir. It should be able to 
get rid of them next. Nice. I guess I really should have just focused on killing instead of dividing my dudes like this. I should start going. I should. I should cover this to make sure the tank cannot go back to heal. <laughs> yep, you can run away, you can run, but you can't hide, bitch. Hey, here we go. <laughs> it did for counting in. That's nice. All right. And you, my friend, are gonna get tripled. Oh, baby, a triple. Let's attack the high HP dude first. Double. And let's see, day eight. Can't be worse. Oh baby, a triple. Ah, the moon force has retreated. Captain this was battle to our strategy. You did a great job. Keep up the good work. No problem, Mel. So she does have her enemies. That's place where this little girl has some serious trouble. This is so forgivable. Next time we'll keep the display of true might. Find rewards. Victory. That's a sad name when I do more. Oh, that's not a name, right? Oh, it is. Let's go. Oof, I was worried for a second there. Save. Yes, please. Holy shit. How long has this been? It's already been 40. Oh, wow. I guess I'll do two more missions and then I'll... This is a long ass tutorial. I'll do two more missions. I'll do... Let's see. One, two, three, four. Who are you doing four? What the fuck? Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. All right. Uh, I'll do six to reach the halfway point and then I'll call it a day. I'm also happy to say that the enemy troops aren't deployed ahead of us. Look at this, an artillery unit has been assigned to your command. Is correctly, this unit will strengthen your battle line. Battle, battalion. Battle line. Battle line. <laughs> no doubt about it. But it sounds like it's seen a lot of action on the phone lines. And I guess we'll just have to fix it, huh? Alright, sure. I received one more bite of information. You also begin an APC to use. This one is fresh from the factory, so don't worry about its condition. Alright, let's get go. Oh, this map looks way bigger. Oh, it's good to see that we have an artillery unit, but it's out of ammo. Oh, okay, okay. And it's almost out of fuel, too. It can't fire without ammo, and it can't move without fuel. In this condition, it's useless. But don't worry, I think we'll manage just fine. We just need supply unit using a transport unit. Oh, okay, okay. When you supply unit, you'll fill this ammo and fuel to the maximum level. For into the specific unit, select the unit and press the R button. Will you select this unit and move it here, please? All right. Check it fast right now, but I guess we'll go down later. Oh, come on. <laughs> the supply command appears in the menu, right? Select the command, please. Supply. Great, now we give them unit in both ammo and fuel. This is how transfer units supply allied units in adjacent spaces. This time we gave supplies to only one unit, but transport units can also provide supplies simultaneously to any unit in the adjacent trade. We fire them with four dancers, huh? Alright, sure. Oh yes, you can also supply units by placing them all in a line basis. And as I explained before, in addition to supplies, bases also provide HP. So use bases when you can, but we can use when you cannot use transport units. Now that the artillery unit is ready, let's go use it to fire. Thank you. Now press the A button again to display command in. It's like fireplace. Oh, this is more, oh, this is a big range weapon. Oops. <laughs> big range weapon. Damn. Okay. That's a lot of damage. These come here to kill units. Indirect fire. Indirect fire is too used for a long distance attack on the enemy. The signal allows units to fire without contact. Oh, okay. yeah, we archers now, baby. 
You cannot get countered. Now the last layer, go ahead and deploy the rest of your troops. It's only a matter of time before the enemy infantry attacks these allied bases. Let's see what we can do to protect them. I think a single tank unit might barely suffice. Please move the unit here. On second thought, protecting these bases with a single tank unit is a little proud. The enemy also has a tank unit nearby, and I think we have to move a mech unit as much as possible. Please select this mech unit. This one. The enemy units are yours to deploy to see fit. Would you like to see these reserve your mice? Yes. There are some neutral cities below us, right? It will be serious trouble if they were captured, so let's send this infantry units down here. I don't know if they will really be that much of a big issue, but sure. I think you can capture cities and engage the enemies at the same time. But watch out for the enemy artillery. If you don't deploy your troops carefully, the enemy will attack them. Oh, I almost forgot. Wouldn't you like to know how you far your units can fire? You Yes, use the B button. The iron is played, yep. When you finish the playing down, your units like the end. Oh, uh, I guess we we have, do have to route. I mean, yeah, routing is easier than capturing for now. So, the units on the bottom should be good enough. There are cursed elves that you're bound and determined to get him away. I have my two so You're looking for. It's your turn. This doesn't look good. Enemy units are closing in. Our mech unit will arrive down to help. But don't panic. There's a ways to use the help that mech unit move a little bit faster and further. Please select this mech unit. Oh, are we gonna be rescued? Now move the unit here, please. Oh. <laughs> Oops. The load command is in the menu, right? Please select the command. You've now loaded the mech unit onto the transport. Transport units can carry both mech and infantry units. This directly increases the movement range for these units. You can't go wrong well using transport units to carry troops. Let's move this unit. Select it, please, and move it to this space. You see the drop command in the menu? Please select this command. After selecting the drop, you'll need to choose where you want to unload. This time, please unload here. Why? Are we supposed to block it? Or oh, whatever. That finishes the drop command. Unloading ends the turn for both the transport and the unloaded unit. Oh, okay, okay. Can't do anything else with them after that. It's a much faster way to reach the distant objectives, though, right? So transport units can supply all units as well as carry infantry and make units. But there is one thing you need to remember. Transport units carry no weapons, which means they cannot fire. Oh, all right. For more detail, press the armor. Yes, we know. Sure, give me a dice. You need to protect these two cities. You should deploy a tank unit to this city in front of the bridge. Next, I will advise moving this artillery unit near here. And there is more one thing about artillery units, and they'll tell you. Artillery units are powerful long range weapons, but they're weak in direct combat. They also can't move and fire in the same turn. Anyway, once you take care of the enemy tank units, you should have any problems within the battle. To win, seize the enemy's queue or wipe all the enemy troops. It's up to you. Wait, what? I can't I can't move and fire in the same turn? That's kinda whack. Alright, fine. This damage is so we take less damage next turn. It might uh, it might go retreat or something. Uh... I don't feel any more, but just in case, I guess. Day two. Oh no. Nice. Yeah, you can't move on fire in the same turn. That's kind of wack, I'm not gonna lie. Pew! Big damage! If they take one turn to fire, it doesn't matter. I think.
Goodbye. Easter tank. Woo! Kaboom! Oh, we can't really do much about- Oh, wait, we can. We can- we can delay the capture. Sure, this guy does less damage on the next turn. I mean, a little less, I guess. There we go. We delayed it. Bye, tank. We wish that's kind of whack. Let's delay the capture then by what by a turn. guys don't move at all. <laughs> oh, maybe if I kill this, this guy will be like, oh, I need to capture. And, you know, he will, he will do lose an action for no reason. <laughs> yep, there we go. Nice, nice, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Such a catchy song, honestly. Pew, pew, pew. I guess I'll try to see if I can. Actually, I should, I'll, I'll kill up first. I don't want to lose people to artillery. It should do a lot, yeah. I know for a fact that he's gonna want to kill the APC. Maybe, maybe the infant. No, no, if it doesn't, whatever, it should be one hit. Oh, no, I, not the, not the car. Ouch. <laughs>
Let's just do some decent damage. One. Can the infantry take it down from here? <laughs> I think it should. Right? Yeah, he barely, yeah, but I think it can. Let's go! Nice. Crap, crap. Oof. You get a few for the flying artillery units? Do do well. Now get going and keep up the good work. <laughs> next time, blast it next time! We don't worry, we only have like six more tutorial missions. Don't worry about it. That's an A rank, let's go! Say current data? Yes, sir! Blue moon, green air. I guess there's more to the factors, eh? One, two, three, four, five. And one more, then we call it for today. The Chuck Company doing region in the Coral Lagoon area has been lost. The Coral Fortress is surrounded by mountains, so it's hard to imagine that there are many enemy units there. Still, our entire company is gone, so. Point is, we can't afford to lose that territory. Time to get going. We use six tank ops. They won. Medium tanks! Oh, could he send some of those too? Explains what happened to the Rican units that vanished. You were your units, I don't know if you can win. But wait! I think I saw this mission in the treehouse. Treehouse footage. I think I did. You win battles with just a show of force though. You know that by now, right? I'm going to leave this one up to you. Do you want this chicken? Sure. For the time being, you can ignore the medium tanks. Just be sure to move into an attack range. Yeah, I know how to do it. Uh, from your strategy. First, take out the enemy units between the rivers. Try to make the most out of your tanks. Make units on artillery. It's so, 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 to secure the neutral cities. The river will protect you for one, but the enemy is interesting. Now, use only the strategic hints after you capture these cities. Good luck. I don't see why I should not. Oh wait, do you think this guy's gonna move? Maybe, maybe we'll move because it's a tutorial. Maybe we'll move yet. Because this is a great chance to get some big damage on the tank and get some terrain. There we go. Ha, see, you failed to mess with my new weapons, Dell. You struggle before the power of the mighty strong forces ever. Oh shit, it is moving. And the tank moved to the forest. They're pretty smart, not gonna lie. Oh shit. Oh. Not the best of position. Oh, never mind. You won't run into my trap! Actually, I don't deserve to get this one, but sure. <laughs> oh, we'll pretend, no pretend I did something right. Kaboom! I do like how the tutorials actually give me a lot more time to. I'm a lot more DVC, I guess, in how I want to do my moves. It's something that I think is pretty cool. So, this guy's here, this guy's here. Tank should be able to let's finish this out. Let's finish this guy off. Might as well. Boom! Dun, 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 dun. We'll retreat the tank after this showdown. Oh, it, this is gonna hurt. Ouchy, ouch. Wait, do I leave the mech? Hopefully I do. Please don't tell me the infantry gets me. Okay, nice. 
Alright. Back to heal up. Can we fire on anyone? We can kill this infantry. Probably four is kinda nice, I'm gonna lie though. Can we kill this? Ah, okay. This guy can though. Pew. And just to be sure, let's drop this guy here so that they can cannot go for my artillery. And capture these two bases. I don't know if we really need this, but uh, the tutorial said I should, so uh, I don't want to anger now, right? right? I get shot by some tank, but I did a lot better than I thought I would, not gonna lie. Little mini tank. I survived. This is, this is, oh, this is tank and this is a medium tank. Uh, the highest of the ground units, okay. So these guys are... This is this, this the big boys, I don't want to mess with those. Let's let this guy heal for now. Uh, can't do nothing for now, let's just stay in the forest. We can probably start capturing the next turn. Tank is... Tank is a priority for sure. Ooh. Nice, nice, nice. Kaboom! Got this ready. Let's let the tank heal for now. Start capturing this. Can we kill this? I think we can. Yes, sir! This guy here, so that we can we can put the, the soldiers in the next one. I just don't want to get on the range of this guy. Wait, did it fuck up? Oh, okay. This. I see. Let's weaken some units with the artillery. They're strong. They're pretty damn strong. They, they will definitely be big units in the actual story for sure. I think. Can we? Yeah, we can, we can finish them off with the other ones, I think. Oh, never mind. Hi. Get some chip here. Are we get there? No, it's gonna take two turns anyway. Oh, what? He's gonna try to capture. Oh. No. Oh. Say hello to my artillery friend. Get them out of here. Get the ass bent. <laughs> This you get to heal raw. Right here so we can blow it up. Start capturing this ones. Six is means it's gonna be you managed to get this far, now I'll get you some mice for future. Oh no, wait, 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 wait. Am I gonna have them move? Is the tank gonna move now because I did this? No, please, please. Trying to cross the medium tanks or cross the river, then trying to capture the enemy's HQ. If the tanks do get across, well, like I said, concentrate on the enemy's HQ. Uh, don't tell me it's gonna move now because I did this. Oh no. Okay, that's good. 
That was kind of scary, by the way. Nice amount of supplies. Let's see what's the match range. Oh. That's not even one car. Damn, I fucked up. If we want to keep away. It's the same at this point. And I'll leave this here. And next turn I'll... Oh wait. Next turn I'll drop this guy and fire with artillery. And, and tank. Sacrifices might have to be made, but what can we do, right? Get ready for the assault. It's only gonna be two turns, so be fine. We have made it pretty clear that we these are the big boys and we're not gonna be able to kill them, so we've all the little points here, let's see what happens. <laughs> Is it gonna wash on? He probably will. Oh, shit. <laughs> God, just don't let them through. Goodbye, sack units. Let's see how much he does. Oh, wait, this jewelry does decent damage. Hold up. Yeah, damn, all right. It, maybe it's not as scary as I thought it was going to be. Uh, never mind, it is kind of scary. 14% from the tank? Yeah, damn, there's nothing. Uh, no matter. Let's finish this. Woo! Honestly, I thought you were done for this time, but you did it. At least I press that for the for the mech dudes. So I have to take the L for the game. But now that all of us mini tanks, our current taxes won't suffice. I have to have central command to send us some tanks too. Keep up the good work. Danny, even my mini tanks were defeated. That now But well, it doesn't look like he has any mini tanks ready to use. I'm sure on your next encounter. It will be bad if the next tutorial taught us how to use medium tanks, right? Ah, oh, shit. Still in rank though, let's go! F for those guys, but it was a sacrifice that needed to be made. Medium tanks are indeed scary. Oof, damn. These tutorials hell long, but goddamn, it's... It goes pretty into detail about what you gotta do, so... I definitely recommend if you wanna start a bastard or you should definitely... Play it too, honestly. <laughs> like, dead ass. Yes. Just keep it for yourself. But so far, it's been pretty fun. I'm liking this game so far. Definitely a lot of fun into the units that you're gonna use and uh, positioning and doing the whole capturing cities and killing them, pulling, pulling back the units and then moving them forward again. This is gonna be a pretty interesting game for sure. Huh. And I'm definitely looking even more forward to a remake now. But of course, first I gotta finish the OG first. So thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.